Happy Monday, campers! Um, made a bit of a boob. Not, yeah. I've got the bacon butties on and I've just realised we've run out of ketchup and we forgot to buy it the other day. So, <laughs> I think we've got some brown sauce in there somewhere. Not as nice, but we're going to have to have brown out with Kaylin. Do you like brown sauce, love? Maybe it's a little bit. We got no ketchup. I wonder what bacon and salad cream tastes oh, like. Oh, I don't know if I could do that. Nah, nah, not for me, it not for me. Well with quiche. This isn't quiche. Yeah, I know. This is a greasy bacon butty. I might try salad cream. <laughs> you have salad cream then. I won't be. Sausages and salad cream's nice. You've had that, yeah, you have sausage and salad cream, don't you, when you have your uh, yeah. barbecue. Yeah, I might start a new trend. Smoky <laughs> bacon and salad cream. Right, sandwich. we'll see how that turns out then. Are you getting your peg? Huh? Are you getting your peg out there for your fishing? Yeah. It'd be nice if you brought a fish home for us to eat again. I could have bought two home yesterday, but I didn't fancy killing a dogfish or two. Do you want some brown sauce on yours? Yeah. Smoky bacon and salad cream. It does work. The proof of the pudding's in the eating, so go and give it a try, guys. Alright. Is that nice? Kaylin? Yeah. Yeah? Mm. I've started a trend. Bacon and salad cream is going down well. I'll try a corner. She won't eat that, so. It's alright, but brown sauce is better. And that's only because we haven't got ketchup. <laughs> mm. Here then. I'll do it again. Yeah, please, and uh, on. Well, Mr. Bertolini, I'm having brass for supper. <laughs> That's the biggest one I've ever had. Buzzing! Making a big hole. Yeah. Oh god. I remember when we went on that fishing boat that time, the first ever fishing boat for me. And we had a bath full of fish. You were you were gutting them, you were cutting them like that, gutting them, and I had to clean them all. A whole bath full of fish. A bath full of but fish. Are you listening, mine, Mr. Bertolini? Mine was the biggest that it was. time. It was. I had the big cod. You did? Four of them. Well, three, three and a half I caught. One was a baby, so it got put back. But I am a fine weather fisherman, aren't I, love? I will not sit out there in the cold and wet. What's that bit? 
Mm. What's that bit? Is that a lung? Do they have lungs? No, they have um, 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 They're not lungs, they're like a buoyancy aid. I can't remember what they call them. Um. It's interesting, isn't it, Kayla? Mm -hmm. This is the inside of the fish. Just stick your finger there a minute. <gasps> Please. There's no sharp well, bits up no, there, No, no, there isn't. I just need to go and get a carrier bag. Just put your finger in there. Uh, in there. Uh, in there, in there. Get it in. I am. Don't drop it. Oh my Hold that God. Oh. What a drama queen. <laughs> you said there were sharp bits. I didn't say there were sharp bits. I said, no, there wasn't. No, I mean earlier. Yeah, they're on, its gill, on the gill plate. The joys of being a fisherman's wife. There you go. Now we both smell like fish, so can I have a shake uh, tonight? This was one finger. One finger, which yeah. I'm going to wipe on you in a minute. I want to wipe my one finger on you. <laughs> Mom, it nearly made you jump like that. It, it made me jump, didn't it, when yeah. it was in the sink? You saw it, didn't you, Kayla? Yeah. I wasn't going crazy. I was going crazy. Were well, we going crazy? Because it was sending us bonkers, wasn't it? Uh -huh. Flapping around in my yeah. sink. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Now I've got a sink full of sand. Nigel, the barbel basher, <laughs> thank you very much for today. It's been a pleasure spending the afternoon with you. I probably wouldn't have caught that fish if he didn't see me bite because I'd come up here for a coffee, hadn't I? Yeah, he'd come up here to... to you as soon know, as my back was turned. Tea girl duties and that. But yeah, he was on it, shouted me, and bang, we were in. <laughs> he had a nice cod. He had a few white in. I think I had a couple of white in as well. And we passed them on to the guy next to us who was not having anything. Oh. Yeah, well, you win some, you lose some. Yeah, we've been a bit like the Jeebus man today, feeding the 5,000 with five fishes and a, a loaf of bread. Oh, that fish might do us twice. Depends what we have. have I'm hoping tomorrow. that we have some nice weather tomorrow and we can get the barbecue out. Yeah, if we can get the barbecue out, that'll be awesome. I want a bit of my egg. Oh, you want a bit of your egg? She's still got a little bit of Easter egg left, so she's going to have that. She's been a good girl and tidied all the bricks away, haven't you? Mm -hmm. Yeah? So we're going to have a little bit of egg and then we'll brush teeth and then we'll get ready for bed. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm getting the bowl clean so I can actually have a wash. <laughs> <laughs> I smell like Grimsby fit, the fish market. Lovely. <laughs> so I was just on the phone to Gadget John and uh, Kaylin's managed to grab a cable tie. I heard a whining. Where has she got that from? Out of my side pocket. Down there. I heard a whining <laughs> and she got a. Go on, show, show everyone. Is show everyone. <laughs> show everyone what you were doing. Go on. Okay, so uh, just another normal day in the Boondocker household. <laughs> Kaylin trying to cable tie her toes. So this was happening. <laughs> <laughs> You're clever, aren't you? Oh dear. <laughs> well, guys, I bet you can't guess what we're what we're having for dinner today. Because there is one slight problem. We may need a bigger barbecue. The fish is too big. <laughs> Not a bad problem to have. Needs to be descaled. Dad, I like fish. You do? Mm hmm. We're going to eat it all. Mm hmm. Dad, I'm going to sit down right here. Oh yeah. Yeah. Dad, it's not done yet, is it? 
No, it won't be done for a while yet. Daddy, look in his tail off. Are ya? No, I'm cutting these bones out. Dad? Mm-hmm? I like you so much a big bit. <laughs> you like me so much a big bit? Yeah. Well, that's awesome. I like you a lot. And a lot. Uh, yeah, I love you a bit. So we've got some new potatoes in there and some broccoli. Kettle's on for a cuppa. Kirsty, you will have to pull the bones out of this. Should have seen that for a sour look. And uh, when that's nearly done. How's that for a little bit of flavouring? Some chilli sauce, sweet chilli, sea bass, potatoes and broccoli and a sweet chilli sauce. How's that sound my love? Lots of butter on the potatoes as well. Oh yes. <laughs> Please, sir, can I have some more? More? <laughs> Is that it? Some butter drizzle. Oh, definitely. <laughs> I'll have it all, all over. Fish and potatoes and broccoli everywhere. Kaylin, dinner! Thank you, my love. Mmm. Just put it there. There you go. Mmm. Is that a little mm -mm. tiny one? It is a little tiny one. What do you think, Kayla? It looks yummy. Yeah? It hasn't got any lemon. No, I took the bones out and that, haven't I? Right. I'm going to eat now. Me and all. Mm -hmm. Well, mm. technically, oh, them are nice if well. you take into account the expense on bait over the last eight years, that bass is probably worth about 400 quid. Oh, it's got to be more. <laughs> <laughs> However, um. I need a bait pump. There's a guy out there. Oh, he's gone. Oh. He pulled about 50 worms up in 10 minutes. Wow. So yeah, Purdy being the entrepreneur that he is, I'm going to get a bait pump. If there's any fishermen along the beach, when I'm around, and I can get some bait, I could sell it. Worms are four quid for 10. Frozen. Fresh, they're generally about a fiver for 10. So, I need a bait pump. <laughs> so Nigel's just turned up and uh, the guy that I was fishing with yesterday, Barbel Basher, and uh, he's just had a taste of the taste of the bass and he said how nice it was. 
and uh, wants to get another piece. Who went, no, I've got fish and chips in the van. <laughs> <laughs> it's clean plate from me. Apart from that manky bit of potato, it was a bit yucky. But you can't guess where I'm going in a couple of hours. I just didn't have room for those last two potatoes. Kaylin? <clears throat> no Easter egg, no sweets, no dippers, no milk, no nothing until your dinner's gone. I want to bring the water. That's all you're going to get. You're not getting anything else. And that's empty. I can. Can you eat some dinner first then for me? I'm gonna have my broccoli. Good girl. Eat it up then, good girl. Mm. Do you think I need to eat your fish? Mm -hmm. I don't like fish. That fish is lovely. Blimey, that wind's picking up a bit. Um, I've just been down for a walk to the toilet. See, what we like about this spot is there's toilets, so we can get water out the taps, we can go use the toilet, there's bins here, somewhere safe to park, and it's right on the beach. Just been to the toilets and the fenced it, fenced all around it. So asked the guy what they were doing. Apparently they're putting a cafe there with decking and all sorts. It's not going to be ready until May. So the toilets are shut, so bang goes my um, in peace. But um, that's probably going to mean lots more tourists coming down here. And probably, no doubt, because you know how the council like to cash in on everything, they're probably going to end up putting... Uh, parking meters or something down here as well so bango's at one of our favorite park ups hmm day four of surviving without ketchup corn beef brown sauce corn beef and brown sauce sandwiches chips and salad cream we can do this I'm not sure about the eggs um though Need ketchup with eggs. <laughs> we're going to the shop tomorrow. Just because we're eating corned beef and chips doesn't mean to say that we're not having fish tomorrow. Oh yeah, we've got fish for breakfast. Waiting. <laughs> About to leave. Already packing. Come with me. I'm not really asking. We'll get.